Welcome back everyone, 645 on this Monday morning. Merry Christmas to those who celebrate. And I was gonna ask you, what is your number one Christmas tradition that you really cherish? So on Christmas Eve, we started it years ago. My mom used to take us to the dollar store and we'd get like $4 and we'd all buy something for the siblings and everybody. And now it's obviously morphed into like much more people involved in it and you spend more now than a dollar. But uh, we just always exchange gifts. So I get like one for every member of my family and they do it. And I have a list going literally all year round. Oh, I love so that. So I can like, I notoriously win Christmas because I'm a very good gift giver. Oh. I'm great at giving gifts, so. Hopefully if we do a secret Santa, I get you. <laughs> you <laughs> no, I get you. I'm actually, yeah, because I'm actually, I was going to say, I actually like to give good gifts too. It's so much fun. <laughs> what about you, any good ones? Uh, I'll tell you when you come back. <laughs> Lots of weather to get to. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> That, this is the way, polite way of saying we got to move on. Good morning, everybody. It is Monday. It is Christmas. We have some drizzle back in the forecast right now. Yesterday, this was a lot more frozen and it caused some issues on the roads out there. Not seeing the same thing for the most part. There still could be a few slick spots, though, as you head out there, but a lot of just wet roads for many people overall. Higher elevations and areas like overpasses or bridges are going to have the most likelihood of being a bit more frozen, which you can see there's other colors on the radar there. Now, wind speeds, nice and calm still. Like we said, it's been calm for the last several days. It's been great. They got almost everyone's power back on. They're going to remain pretty calm here as you go through your day as well. If you're getting on the roads at all, make sure you watch out for the black ice, but also it's foggy in some areas, especially in southern Maine, we're seeing down and under a mile of visibility. So just take your time on the roads. Current temp sitting somewhere in the 30s, a bit warmer than where we were yesterday. For the day overall, gonna be pretty good. I mean, it's not gonna be the perfect day. It's gonna be cloudy out there, not gonna see a ton of sunshine, but we're also gonna have temperatures that are a bit more mild. This is the most snowfall you're gonna see on this graphic. So you're not gonna see much snow or really any as you go through your day here today. Temperatures stay mild for the next several days as well, getting up into the mid 40s. So we're gonna stick with that general trend as we move through before we cool off for the weekend. That means the next system moving through is going to stay as rain. Could see a few showers Wednesday morning and throughout the day, but the bulk of it's really going to come overnight into Thursday morning. Not the same story as last time, you guys. Significantly less rainfall, even though you still could see everything rising up in the creeks, streams, and rivers, but maybe to action stage, but not anywhere near where we were last time, to just clarify that. Winds a little bit breezy, but not, again, anything near what we had. Then as we get into the second half of Thursday into Friday, you could see some of this freezing on the back end and getting a couple little snow showers in the forecast. For your marine forecast, seas are going to be at 2 feet for your day today. Winds out of the south around 5 to 10 knots. Otherwise, as we look through the rest of the week, I mean, nothing that overly exciting either way. I mean, it's, there's nothing crazy amazing right now. There's nothing crazy bad either, but next weekend's looking awesome. Going to be cooler, but we should have more sunshine back in the forecast, which I think we're all okay with. Yeah. So, I mean, a little bit of everything this week, but it's a lot more calm, which is what we need. Right. So I think we're all okay with that. So and we're going to kind of be the there. end of the week. We get a little bit of sunshine. Yeah. So it'll be a good week. Yeah, it's going to be great. So to answer your question, I'm Jewish, so I don't celebrate Christmas, but my mom's side of the family does celebrate Christmas. And we used to go to my grandmother's um, house on Christmas Eve in Costa Rica. And she had a big dinner, lots of gifts for everybody, and there were like 50 people because everybody like came to my grand That's grandmother's so nice. house. So I do remember, and I loved those holidays, but I haven't been like in four years because I've been here working. We'll have to change it. <laughs> I know. <laughs> we'll, next year. We'll, we'll do the show from Costa Rica next year. I love that idea.